Okay, people, let me see you strut your stuff. Okay. <laughs> nice pout. Next to my hair, it's my best feature. <laughs> Mio, hi. Why didn't you tell me your dad doesn't want you to see me? I can't believe Sue told you. I can't believe you didn't. I didn't tell you because I didn't know how. Girl, so you let me to think I was in good with your dad and the whole time he hated my guts? But he doesn't hate you. He just thinks I can do better than the next con. I don't get it. I thought you said you told him all about me. I did. I just didn't tell him about the gang stuff. Why? Because you ashamed of me? You know I don't care about your past. I care about you. Oh, but that's all he cares about, right? No. He's also very big into Lauren Hill. <laughs> Why are you joking about this? Because I am embarrassed, Neil. How do you think it makes me feel knowing that my dad can be so shallow? No, but he never even gave me a chance. He does me without even getting to know me. You know, he thinks I'm some lowlife that ought to just crawl back into the gutter. Neil. No, tell me I'm wrong. Okay, Sue, show them how to sell these clothes and make me rich. Hey, I'll turn the heat up in this red hot slip dress. You'll have to call the fire department to put me out. Watch me sizzle. I am not saying this girly stuff. Cray, how else will people know what you're wearing? Gee, I don't know. Maybe they can just look at me. Hi, I'm Ben. We both know I look good, but only one of us knows your phone number. Are you Marcy Blake? Yes. Are you looking for something for your girlfriend, wife, death sergeant? You're under arrest for selling stolen property. Stolen? I paid top dollar for this stuff. Okay, it was dirt cheap, but money changed hands. <laughs> Sorry, kid, you got taken. Uh, Back it up, boys. You can't do that. Tell it to the judge. Neil, why don't you come in? <laughs> this isn't right. You can't keep me and Kate from seeing each other. Really? Well, the last time I checked, I was still her father. Yeah, but you never even gave me a chance, man. You were prejudiced against me from the start. You're talking trash now. We're both black. How can I be prejudiced against you? It's not about race, all right? It's about class. You think just because you come from money, you're better than me. You better watch your tone, young man. Look, Mr. Richards, I'm sorry. All right, all I'm saying is you're lucky to come from privilege, all right? But that doesn't mean you can look down on me. Look, I'm not going to apologize to you about who I am or where I came from. Neither am I. How come you just can't see me the way Kate sees me? Because I'm not some dreamy 17-year-old girl who thinks she's in love. Kate used the L word? <laughs> Never mind. Look, man, I mean, I turned my life around. But hey, hey, I'm an honest student now. I've got a great future ahead of me. Well, what's to say you won't go right back to your old friends? I've seen it happen. Huh. You know, I can be a complete jerk. But if I came from the right people, you'll like me just fine. Look, son, I want what's best for Kate, and it's not you. Yeah, you're prejudiced, all right? Look, and because of that, you'll never know who I really am. Stay away from my daughter. <laughs> father call my son a loser. Mom, he said a lot of rotten stuff, but he never called me a loser. Doesn't he realize the disadvantages that you've had? I mean, come on. The kid has clawed his way out of a hole. Doesn't that count for anything with that pompous snoot? <laughs> Eat a little, honey. I mean, he just wouldn't listen. Okay, is this how it's gonna be from now? Never be able to get away from my past? Son, you have nothing to be ashamed of. Neil? Hey, Kate, what are you doing here? We need to talk. What was... Let's go, Dave. Give the kids some privacy. I'm just gonna hang here on the other side of the door so I can hear. This is gonna be good, I can tell. <laughs> My dad told me what happened. 
I know. I got all up in his face. I mean, I just wanted him to hear my side. You stood up to him. I'm proud of you. <laughs> <laughs> hey, you better get out of here, because if your dad sees you here with me, it can get ugly. I don't care what my dad says. I'm going to keep on seeing you. By sneaking around behind his back? Yep. Great idea, huh? <laughs> Oh, yeah, except for one thing. I won't do it. Why not? He's acting like a big old stuffed jerk. You got that right. But, hey, man, that beat us out. Is that I don't play that? Are you saying that we can't see each other anymore? <sighs> Kate, as much as I care for you, I'm not going to get between you and your dad. I got behind on the laundry, but one of you kids should have said something. The clothes Marcy bought at the internet were stolen. So the cops took them all back. You know what the warehouse needs? Bigger menus. <laughs> Much bigger menus. Sue, why are you wearing a plastic bag? Because the cocktail napkins kept falling off. <laughs> this is awful. Now I have no clothes to sell, no way to get my investment back. Well, if something sounds too good to be true, it is. Mm. How many times have I told you that? Seven. Well, this has been great, but I have a party to go to. Shouldn't someone tell Ben he left without his pants? <laughs> Not me. I told him last time. <laughs> this is the best barbecue we've ever had. Yeah, the chicken's moist, the burgers are juicy, and I still have both my eyebrows. <laughs> Excuse me. Is this the Blake residence? You found it. I'm Dave Blake. You're Neil's father? Yeah. Who are you? I'm William Richards. I'm Kate's dad. The snob? Are all of these children yours? Do you have a problem with that? Settle down, Zena. Look, for Kate, she's not here. I know. She's in the car. I came to talk to you. All right. Neil. I was wrong about you. Kate said that you wouldn't sneak around to see her. Fresh buns coming through. <laughs> oh, my, another one. You were saying you were wrong about me? Well, I judged you solely on your past. Well, I'm glad to hear you say that. Well, it took guts for you to confront me. And you've got integrity. I like that. I think you and Kate will make a fine couple. So we're cool? If you accept my apology. He does! <laughs> he does! Well, only on one condition. Uh, Neil, don't push it. <laughs> no, but this is important. Mr. Richards, I mean, for now on, if you have something to say, say it to me. You know, man to man. Deal. Neil, is everything all right? I'm here if you need me. <laughs> Yeah, we're cool, Mom. Actually, I was gonna ask Kate and her dad if they wanted to stay for a barbecue. Mm. Hey, it's really good. I mean, no one's got sick yet. <laughs> well, with an invitation like that, who could refuse? Huh? <laughs> it's premiere day on TNBC with all new episodes and a new show, Just Deal. Jermaine? We're like brothers. I mean, he spends more time at my house than his own. We don't hang out as much as we used to anymore, ever since Ash came along. Dylan's a nice guy. Is he cute? <laughs>